Hello dear friends, good morning. We will have a cup of tea and let me just first get started so that we will not waste the hot water. So this tea is the the uh, fruit tea with apple peas. I think it's called berry something because there is berry in it. Very berry or something. I forgot exactly how it is named. And uh, I bought it loose tea so there is no way to find it. Oh, what is there is a piece? not a big problem putting and this teapot because um, there there was a drainer when I bought it the drainer got broken so um, <clears throat> so I was uh, it's myself I broke it so I went to the shop uh, went back to the shop I don't want to buy another drainer I do not, uh, I did not want to just return it because I made a mistake. There is no way I can return it. And also it does not make me feel comfortable if I want to return it. Anyway, I was uh, going back to fix it, uh, to buy another drainer and uh, the shop owner is a very kind person. He could not find another drainer exactly the same size, so he made me, or he, 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 he got this little steel wear, so that uh, it actually works even better this way. Hmm. A little bit of background knowledge of this. So today, such a beautiful day, I woke up with anger. I think it's morning anger. I do not know whether this is uh, only myself has it or everybody has it uh, or s some other people have it. Oh. It must not be that everybody has this morning anger. And uh, <clears throat> I remember one day I saw one one person and he told me that uh, every day when I wake up, it's a great day. It just things happen that not so great. But um, I think it's been a quite long. When I was young, I have this morning anger. I woke up and I feel not happy. And there is an unknown anger that uh, stored from um, from uh, last night. I didn't have a bad life. I didn't have a bad day, and just uh, find no reason. And uh, I spoke. I wasted my time. Something. It's quite unfair. But this just this morning anger. You need to 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 spit it out. Maybe because um, you ate something too much, you could not digest. Usually for me it's the case that uh, I woke up once, I woke up bloated, I feel really not happy. Or I woke up with too much water in my body or too much salt in my body. It makes me very, very unhappy. So I have this unknown, or actually known, anger in myself. But otherwise, I should not have that much anger. And uh, anyway, it happened from time to time. And um, I woke up to this beautiful morning, but did not have a good spirit. So I just chilled down myself a little bit, and now it's getting better. I'm not angry anymore. A lot of time, 
we have many many feelings many many kind of emotion of sensation or many many kind of things inside ourselves sometimes we can digest sometimes we cannot sometimes we know the reason sometimes we do not even know the reason and uh, <clears throat> There is not very much we can do. Keep an open mind, an open heart, and swallow <coughs> the things that. Uh, sorry. <coughs> Sometimes we cannot uh, know the reason, and uh, it does not make any. It is not the point to find out the reason why we are not happy. It's the point that. Uh, we walk out and find, regain our energy and regain our happiness. That is more important. It looks so beautiful, this cup of tea. Maybe I should take a, a photo of it. Beautiful morning with a beautiful cup of tea. How do I arrange this little spoon? Okay, put it here. A picture for it. Picture for you. Picture for me. Maybe this way. I'm sorry, there might be some noise around the electric device. So, <clears throat> that's good. That cuts the fat. I was just opening up Yahoo News. The Yahoo page is my front page. Yahoo News mentioned five teas you should drink to burn out your fat. I think those kind of... The, the, it, it becomes such a miss that they, they just some small tiny things they like to blow it up and make it into a big thing tea is just a cup of water it, if you have a, a good sense of, uh, of a good life or a healthy life you will be careful on everything and anything everything will do favor to you and, uh, not uh, that you drink a cup of tea you can become uh, you can become healthy and fit so more than that okay <clears throat> now we are at this tea and uh, I would like to answer your questions one by one as much as I can I will read through your questions let me see the video request for questions I am just not doing well I have 1,000 view for this video and uh, just not doing well anyway it's not important so the very first question I will read hi okay I have a question I have quite a few questions here goes how did you meet your husband help and and uh, how is Kevin? Would you tell a story, your story, maybe even do a video on where you were born, what your parents did for living, etc. Can you tell the story of how you came to live 
in so many countries. I was so touched when I saw your video of your home in China. The profound statement you made about how this was where your mother brought you home to and raised you. Now you are there without her. It was something like that. It made me emotional. Maybe it would just be a good idea to make separate video. Yes, I will make separate video. Turn all of our questions into a flowing narrations as they happen to add in the other questions you'd like to answer so much. I'd love to know more about Kevin, especially how did he get such a serious name. Yes, I find it quite Pat's name, human name. Okay, so <clears throat> how I meet my husband? I think this is a private uh, thing I would not like to share with you. And. Uh, and uh, it's, a, it's a question that uh, it's kind of things that you are very comfortable to talk with your friend, with your close friend, or not even so close friends, with a girlfriend. You can chat with it and uh, privately, or just the two of you, or just the three of you, a few of you. Even in a party, you can talk about it. But uh, put this kind of uh, this kind of things, information, things, and chats, chit chats, in the on 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 social media public sites. I am just not feel so comfortable. One day we meet each other, I will definitely tell you this story from beginning to the end. No, there is no end. From the very beginning, and I have written some stories about it. And once I, I posted on our school's, uh, um, school's uh, blog, as a memory of uh, of our youth, youth age, and people were quite uh, quite uh, liked it and uh, quite uh, interested in it. But anyway, it's uh, everybody's life is interesting. When we think about, go back, look back at our life many, many years ago, how we came to this day. It's a very fascinating experience. And uh, in my case, it's nothing less than, ex than those fascinating. So, <clears throat> so let's just hope one day we will meet each other and I will tell you this story. Another thing, how is Kevin? Haven't Kevin disappeared? And uh, just disappeared. We do not know. We were very sad. We, we are still very sad. And uh, when we come home, we still call his name, Kevin, Kevin, Kevin. And uh, every day on our way, driving home, and close to our neighborhood, not even that close, even on the streets. Once it's entered, entered into the residential streets, we will call him name, Kevin Care. I will say Care, and my son will say Ven Care, Ven Care, Ven we call whichever way we could, but still we, Kevin did not appear. Kevin is not appearing in front of us. We were very sad. So, <clears throat> 
the beginning of the story, when we came back from Australia, that was uh, five years ago, I think. It's, uh, <笑>对没关系我建议今天天真好而且小鸟叫声这么好你待会儿去我们骑车去吧然后四个人都去<笑> 嗯。So when we came back from Australia, that's about five years ago, and we were looking for a house, and we found a house, and after some times we bought this house, and then we had a neighbor moving and then move out, and our neighbor had a cat, so this neighbor left a cat, a yellow cat and uh, wanted us to take care of and uh, we we were very happy to take care of the cat and the cat usually do not stay in our house and uh, and uh, the neighbor left a cat tower and uh, cat tower and uh, and the cat food the dry food for us to feed and this is when I realized that cat, there is actually a cat food for, for cat. When I was young, we did not had, uh, did, we do not use cat food. Anyway, so the cat was kind of shy, and uh, maybe because the boys didn't treat him well. <laughs> the cat, the yellow cat, was shy, and uh, we never see the cat in front of our eyes it always disappear but the food also sometimes disappear anyway at the end of the day the at the, at the end of uh, a few months the cat owner finally found a house for that cat so he came to pick it up and the cat run the yellow cat run into the owner and just do not like that Anyway, it's not the right karma for us. I think at the same time, we saw other cat came in to us. And my boys said it was Kevin. And, uh, and then we started to use that cat food for this cat, for Kevin. Use that, that cat, yellow cat's food for Kevin. Anyway, there are too much to consume. I think we still had some. Just cats do not like this dry food. And, um, and he came once in a while, and we liked. And then we started to buy cat food. We buy the, I think one time we, we bought some uh, cat, because he came, so we bought one cat food. Uh, a liquid, a wet, I think it's called wet cat food, and he enjoyed so much. So we started to keep buying, and finally we found what brand they like, and everything. And we keep buying, so every month, every week, we will buy one, 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 uh, one pack of cat food. So we kept buying. And uh, the cat came, such a beautiful cat, black and white and striped. And uh, his name is actually, up to now, we did not know it's a, a man cat or it's a he cat or she cat, male or female. So let's say he, we, we call him he. He came and his name is Sparky. So we never called him Sparky. 
And at that time, my boys are fascinated by a movie, Goals. Goals, there are two characters, many characters. One is uh, Munez, Diego, Diego Munez, Diego, Diego Munez, the main character, play soccer. And another one is uh, Kevin Harris. Kevin Harris or Gavin Harris, I forgot, and then they told me it's Gavin Harris. Anyway, in the movie there is one line, it's called, if you see Gavin Harris, if you see Gavin Harris, tell him, Scheiser. <laughs> anyway, we do not know what it is, what is exactly name, but I know German words, that is not a very, it's kind of joking anyway, it's not a, uh, a good word. And then we thought, Gavin, Gavin, this character is played so well, it's just so fascinating. It plays a, a playboy and, uh, and, a, and a talented footballer, just everything. We, we, we were fascinated by his play. So we, <coughs> we, one day we were thinking about names. We had all the toys around. How do we call Kevin, which my little boy? Uh, how do we call Sparky? We should not call him Sparky. We should give him a name. We thought about Jeremy, because Jeremy Lin. And we thought about uh, yeah, some, something, some uh, drones. Jonas, so something fun. Anyway, we thought all the name, and finally we found out how about Kevin, Kevin Harris, Kevin. So we started to call him Kevin. Yes, everybody agree with it, and so we call him Kevin. So that's the starting of the name. He got his name just because uh, because we want to kill. We, 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 we have fun naming the thing that uh, we have and uh, also we named our uh, toys a panda toy something pampa no I forgot and another little fox name is Jerry Jeff starting from Jeremy Jeremy Dean was so cool so we call him Jerry <laughs> and uh, and uh, yeah, the crab has a name, flash toy, a plush toy. The, the crab has a name, the little fox has a name, and the uh, little uh, bear has a name, teddy bear has a name. So <coughs> that's the starting of Kevin. And we liked Kevin so much. We bought food every time when we have party, Kevin will come, Kevin would come, and uh, one of our friend, she, it's a couple, lovely couple, they are cat people. They had, uh, they have uh, four cats in their house, and uh, they took care of their cats. They do not have children, and they, 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 the, the cats are their children. And uh, they will tell the cat, mommy is back, daddy would like to be, anyway, it's a cat family. And uh, they tell us, why not you adopt a cat? And they also help with uh, humanitarian work on the cat, taking care of the wild cat. Strained cat, anyway. And, um, but it never strike a chord on me to adopt a cat. Anytime when there is a farmer's market, when we went to pet shop, we will stay a long, very long time in the cat adoption place, but we just could not afford it. I could not afford it. I could not afford it because it will be a pain when, when the cat disappears. I could not afford that pain. I could not handle that pain. Many, many, many years ago, about 40 years ago, 
my mother brought back home, or maybe even 45 years ago. My mother brought home a little cat, and it was a teeny tiny little Persian cat in her bag, and showed us and said one of her colleagues had a cat made made baby and if we would like to take care of that cat. So we tried one day, we loved it so much that baby cat could not even walk. It just newly born, new, new, new born. So we got the cat for one day and then my mother took it back because we decided to take. So a few days later, that little Persian cat came and it has a face like a tiger, so we called him Hu Zha Tiger and call him Mimi. We, 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 we call whichever way we could to name him. He came and stayed with us and we loved him so much. We were poor, we could not find, we could not afford good food. So we give him dry f uh, bread to eat. He does not eat, but he likes to eat the food when we chew it. So for him, we chew our food and then spit it out, and then he could eat. It may sound not so good, sound a little bit, yeah, but uh, that is the way how the cat would like to eat. So we feed him, and sometimes we save our money to buy some thrown away fish to feed him. In the fish market, sometimes they throw away some fish tail and fish head. We brought back home to feed him, and he became such a wonderful and kind of vicious, a wonderful and playful, joyful little cat. But one day he disappeared, and we were crying. We were so sad. I just cannot tell you how sad we were. And then, a couple of days later, it appeared again. Oh, we were overjoyed with the sight of our little cat. And. Uh, Another time, he disappeared again. We were sad. Another time, he came back again. This has happened a couple of times, two or three times. We were happy, we were sad, until one day he disappeared, and we were dreaming he must be coming back again. We waited one day, not show up. Second day, no show. Third day, no show. Three, four, five days, no show. And then we start to sense something not right. Whenever we saw something, uh, the boys killing cats or, or throw rocks on the cat, or if there, we had some news of cat uh, had traffic accident, we were thinking, oh, it must be our. It must be our cat. We lived in this life torture and the grilling of our heart for one week, two weeks, until we realize that our cat will never come back. And we, my sister and I, and my mother, we cried. We just so sad. Every day, it was such a depressing and sad week, sad months. So from then on, I, I decide that uh, I will not take a cat. I will not take an animal because it's so pain to see it, uh, to see it gone. Maybe this is not a good decision. Anyway, this is my decision. I just do not want to take any. So we did not adopt and the cat. And so come back to Kevin's story. 
Kevin came back to us now and then and we were very very happy and um, and uh, then we we because we travel sometimes we went to France we went to travel just uh, other things so we travel and uh, when we came back Kevin first we will see Kevin. Sometimes we see Kevin immediately. Sometimes in a couple of days, Kevin will resume his habit of coming back to us. And uh, usually when we stay here, the Kev Kevin will come. And uh, when we drive back home near the neighborhood, we will call Kevin's name. We open the door, we were thinking, maybe cat can smell our our smell, can sniff our smell. And um, there was one time we stopped the car and Kevin was far away. And, uh, and Kevin just ran to us, sprinted to us. Oh, we were so happy at that time. So <clears throat> the sight of Kevin has become, uh, has become a uh, a joy for us and uh, he just uh, came here every day we buy food for him we know it's a neighborhood cat that he has an owner and uh, and uh, and uh, he he had an owner and uh, but he everybody in the neighborhood knows him I think uh, he's not only in our home but I feel that uh, just calculating the day and time he stays with us, we know he must be sp spending most of his time with us. He had spent spend nights with us, and we were so happy. And uh, then the next day or a few days later, the owner will come and say, did you see Kevin? And then Kevin will <laughs> very shyly come out. Kevin, come out. Your mom is here. Mm. So, and uh, there were times Kevin, Kevin is a real cat. He catches mouse, rats and mouse. And whenever there is a cat, there were times Kevin came back home with a dead mouse that Rats had and put it us <laughs> half dead actually. The head diggling in. Anyway, it's, uh, it's not a good sight. And, uh, it's his way of, uh, of uh, showing us that uh, he's proud, I think. And uh, So there was one time we went to ski just a couple of uh, weeks ago during the Christmas we went to ski and we came back Kevin did not show up and then a couple of days later I think he found our flavor again our smell again he came back and then we were so happy and uh, there was one time we eat some mutton, lamb, and uh, bien ABC, très 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 ABC. So we feed Kevin, Kevin ate. At the very first he liked it, and then he did not like. We didn't know what is the reason. And then from then on Kevin disappeared, never came back. And for the first few days we say it's because daddy's, daddy's lamb is not delicious. He did not like it. And then it's been how long? It's been one month. He never appeared again. So we were thinking maybe the family moved away or something maybe they went at first they must be in vac on vacation and took the cat 
and now maybe they just moved away. Kevin disappeared. He disappeared. We still have cat food for him. We still call his name when we come back home. I think this will become our tradition, our legacy, just to keep calling his name whenever we drive back home. Kevin is so dearly missed.